hit the road. Uh, we are heading to Bellbrook Farms. It's a place in uh, right near Lake Wyvernhoe. So I know it's not that far away. So um, we were just staying there for one night just because we're sort of heading off Lake Arbor this afternoon. So um, we found this, it's a really cool farm that we thought that the dogs would love. So we booked that a little while ago. But um, yeah, so Zara should love it. Um, and it looks really nice on the website. So I'm really excited to show you guys. Um, Josh is driving. It's, it's a massive motorhome, so I'm a little bit, a little bit scared to drive it at the moment. Got to get used to it. But uh, we got little Zara here. Wait, in the back, gone. In the back, off you go. That's her spot over there, right near the window. She loves to look out at the cars, so that'll be her spot for the next four weeks. But um, we'll show you guys the rest of the van and the farm when we get there. Well, we have made it out to the farm. I'll show you guys a look. So this place is called Bellbrook Farms. We're just staying here the one night and um, it's right by Lake Wyvernhoe and... Just down there. Is it? Yeah. So our our campsite is the, yeah the view of Lake Wyvernhoe. So she'll be nice. Hey Zara, are you excited? All right, we are here. Look at this. Our motorhome campsite fire pit. There's the lake down there. So where we are, you literally can't see it. Don't even know where the other campsites are. But they all pretty much have a view of the lake, so we'll take you down there. Go down there so you can have a look. Step one, run away with me. We'll find some place we're meant to be, where the grass is greener on the other side. Step two. I can make a story, I promise that it won't be boring I'll pack our things, we'll head so far away I've been waiting for a long time to feel alive mm, So take my hands, our problems will subside Step three, that'll do the floor. Morning, just woken up to a beautiful sunrise I can give you more than life can give that morning coffee and then head down to the lake for a bit of a walk. Take Zara for a swim, maybe. I've been waiting for a long time to feel alive. Yeah, you told them, didn't you, Zara? I'm so taking my head out. Alright, first cast. Are we on yet? <laughs> Zara! So no luck with the fishing. I've never actually done any freshwater fishing before, so I wasn't expecting much. But I thought we'd kill a bit of time, come for a quick flick. Make the most of uh, Zara being able to swim while she's, while she's still can. No crocs here. She's literally been swimming. The whole way. Keep going. Come on. Get on to the next spot. Where are we going next? Check out Blaney and Montville and Kenilworth. Apparently the Kenilworth Bakery is really good, so I'm going to check that out. And, um, I'll show you guys what we get up to there. Still swimming. Alright, we've just pulled up in Kenilworth. We're just staying the night at the Kenilworth showgrounds. Um, we needed a spot to charge up the van so it's actually really nice here. It's all out on a farm so two cows here, a little river. 
Uh, today we just drove around Mulaney and Montville, just had a little look around, exploring and staying here the night and then tomorrow we're going to head to Rainbow Beach, so shall be good. So we're heading to Rainbow Beach today, but just before we go, we're going to try out the Kenilworth Bakery. Okay. What's in the box? I wasn't too fussed about that. I was more keen. This. <laughs> it's arrived here at Tin Can Bay. Stop in on our way to Rainbow. Absolute perler of a day. And Zara's gone swimming again. Look at this. Just on our way into Rainbow. You come and wait it's uh, me every night. lunchtime, getting quite warm, so we thought we'd come in for a bit of swim in this freshwater creek here. Have oh, a look at that. I don't know if you can see that hill right there. Massive. Catch my head in the earthquake, collect my spine. When my disgrace, when my disgrace, catch my it's love. Not that deep, so just be careful. Give me some peace, oh darling, please. One, two, <laughs> please. You said push you on, push one. Okay. Hands are ready. Okay. Okay, I won't tell you. One, two, three. It's supposed to push me on two. Tell me. Yes, but you're too fat. Just jump. God damn it. All right, we just got down to Rainbow Beach. It's absolutely beautiful down here. Check this out. Going to cook up some lunch here and have a feed and then enjoy the beach for the other. down the beach. Anyways, let's go for a swim. So Josh is all rigged up, he's going to have a fish, and Zara loves it. So we just checked in at the Rainbow Beach Holiday Park. So we're staying there for two nights, tonight and tomorrow night. And um, we decided just before the sun went down, we'd go for a little sunset fish and um, check out Inskip. So it's 
just a little bit a little bit further from Rainbow Beach. We just drove there. There's some parts you can actually drive like two-wheel drive. So just found this place, parked out on the road and a little beach. And because we met up with our uh, with my parents, um, my they actually got us some pippies because they're camping down Double Island. So they got like lots of pippies for us, so for those who call them yuguris. Pippies, yuguris, whatever you want to call them. So we're going to cook them up and have them for dinner tonight, which I'm so keen for because I love them. But um, yeah, so for now, watch the sun go down, have a fish, I got this. pretty early this morning because Zara's been having such big days she's been exhausted so she's been falling asleep like four o'clock in the afternoon but then that means that she wakes up quite early so she woke us up but bonus is we got to watch the sunrise so that was really nice literally just from our bed outside our window so it was good um we had a bit of a slow morning this morning Josh just did some editing finished some video um, and I just sort of tidy up the van and one thing about camping sort of close to the beach a lot of sand so that's just probably something that I've got to deal with no matter how much you clean the van there's always going to be sand uh -oh. he's running down to the fisherman okay. Zara come on come on she loves fishing so much. Come on. Good girl. Come on. <laughs> Look at this little girl. Hello. Hello. You like the fishing? Josh has just got his drain out, so he's just been having a bit of fun with that. So you might be able to see a shot or two. But yeah, the wind's not. Yeah. Don't have to stay Cause I can feel it coming It's time to get out of this place But you never forget about the way that you felt When you crash landed and burned into some place else But you've never ever been And you never wanna leave Cause next thing you know But you never forget about the way that you felt When you crash landed and burned into some place else but you never to Harvey Bay now. 
now. So, we're all ready to go. Just one last stop, Rainbow Beach. Look at this.